Hi, this is Dr. Joni Liu, and I'm back with another Cosmic Tidbit. Continuing on the line that I was referring to last time, I want to talk about our, our thoughts and our feelings, because this is about true cause and effect. What we feel and what we think about has a direct effect on our bodies and actually even on our environment. I have a happy story. I mean, there was, oh, many decades ago when my kids were still in their teens and I was planning on a Caribbean trip, you know, go back to Jamaica. And it was hurricane season and it was a particularly bad hurricane season. But I had decided that we were going to go anyways. I picked a particular week and just figured it's going to be good. You know, regardless of what happens with the weather, we were still going to enjoy ourselves. And so we got to Jamaica and apparently there had been heavy rain and all that at the particular location that we were at, but we stayed and we had a terrific week. The entire week was fantastic. And then on the day that we left, it started to rain again. Now, at the time, I really didn't know what I had done. I didn't really understand it. But now I do, looking back. I had set an intention, or I had let go. That's what it really was. I had let go of what might happen on my vacation, and it turned out fantastic. And that is called trust. That is trusting in the cosmos. I know that today. I know it for a fact that that is exactly what happened. And since I've been studying this about the cosmic way, and I'll be sharing with you where it came from sooner or later, but since I began to study this, I have really begun to trust in the cosmic way to take care of me. This is an important fact because cause and effect is due to our feelings and our thoughts. So I can catch myself, but not perfectly, okay? But I'm telling you that everything that has happened since March, 2020 has been very good because I have more friends than ever. I have more trustworthy friends than ever. I have friendships that have blossomed into remarkable things. I've met people that have led me to believe in myself even more and to have more confidence in my goals and creating new goals. You see, I'm 66 years old. I'm not done living. Retirement? What's that? That doesn't exist for me. And I feel young and vibrant and healthy. And I thank the cosmos for introducing me to itself finally, because it was definitely waiting for me to wake up. I'll be back with another cosmic tidbit. Take care. Bye.